Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox video and today we are going to be bringing back object competitions. So it's been over a year, about a year and a half now uh, since we have done one of these and yeah it used to be, um, a lot of you used to really enjoy these and yeah a lot of you have voted for them to come back as well and I did make a little video about it about a week ago now uh, bringing these object competitions back so that is exactly what we are doing today. So the object that you guys have picked, I have no choice in what is picked, it's all up to you guys. So the object that you guys have voted for in the Discord server so if you'd like to um, submit and vote which objects you want to see in these competitions, make sure you're on my Discord server. Link in the description will have polls and stuff where you can pick and choose um, which objects and suggest ones. So yeah, the object that you guys have picked is HD95. 086b and just a little information on this planet as well so it's not just competition we've got a bit of uh, facts and stuff in here as well so it is a exoplanet it orbits a uh, pre-main sequence star hd95086 it's roughly about five jupiters mass in size or in mass sorry not size so it's about yeah five jupiters mass um it orbits its star from around 55 to about 60 au um, as well, and it was discovered in 2012 to 2013, roughly. So yeah, a little bit of uh, information on the planet. And yeah, we have had six of you submit objects in uh, for this competition. And we're doing something a little different. For anyone who saw the original series, I used to pick out a winner judging by what I liked. But this time, it's all on you guys. I will put a vote in myself um, in the next episode. So we'll announce the winners in the next episode. So we don't just do it in these videos anymore. So you get time to vote and, and just think about it in general. Vote and then obviously plan um, the next object as well but yeah so it's a slightly different structure so i vote with you guys and it's all about the winner is what we all vote together not just what i think is the best so it's a little more fair and yeah you guys can all uh, vote the winner so here are the objects down here i haven't spawned them yet but they are here in the menu so i put the this is just a regular bog standard one in the game so this just spawns with any old um texture so there's nothing uh, special there but we'll keep this just regular one in that i put here as a comparison right so the first object is Zane B's HD here. So let's see what we he has made us. Right, here we go. So HD 950A6B. It's quite a cold planet as well, I believe, since it is orbiting quite far away from its star. So I'm not ex we're not expecting like super hot planets here because, yeah, it is about 50, 50, 60 AU away from its uh, main sequence star. So, yeah, it's an A-class star as well. So, yeah, nothing like super, super crazy. Um, but, yeah, here we go. So this is Zane B's one. So it's a blue and white color theme, as we can see here. 4.4 Jupiter, so he has based it directly off the one in the game here. So here we go. See so yeah, a nicer blue and white shade there. So that is Zane B's submission. Now, moving on, we have got, um, I'm um, apologies, I'm going to completely scrap your name here, but uh, Erexed, Era XD. Yeah, I'm really sorry, I just cannot say it. But yeah, this is his submission, so let's see what he has uh, made for us here. So it's a very, very dark teal colored gas giant, as we can see here. Kind of reminds me of my Planet 9, actually, um, colour-wise. It looks a little more vibrant than my old uh, Planet 9. But yeah, here is his submission. Let's make it a little larger in size, just so it uh, so they're all roughly the same size. So yeah, about, about, about that. There we go. So, so they're all nicely lined up. Right, now moving on, we have got Gigaman's HD here. So let's see what he has prepared for us. So here we go. So this one has also got a nice uh, mix of different coloured bands. Let's just make it larger in size as well. So it compares all the other ones. And let's also just rotate it the correct way up here. So it's got a mix of purples, indigos in there. Some with some darker greys added in as well. So that is Gigaman's HD 950A6B. So there we are there. Moving on, we have got Goombas, or he's now known as um, Tai. So T-A-I. Oh yeah, this is what he has made for us. So this one is uh, a lot smaller. So we'll definitely have to buff the size of this guy up. So let's quickly just go ahead and do that. That's a little too big. Uh, let's just put it to 0 0.5 and then there we go. So that's roughly correct. So this is Goomba's old one. So here we are here. So there is Goomba's object. So it's got a, a mix of more pale colours. We've got some blues in the North Pole, some blues in the South Pole. And then it's got like a yellowish orange band in the middle surrounded by two white grey coloured bands. So there we are. That is that one. Right, now next up we have got Mad Planet Guys um, one here. So this one looks to have a lot of bands by its image there. So here it is. So it's a, a mixture of different colours here, Jupiter sort of style of colours. It's also got that dark spot feature. You can see that as a little dark patch that moves with our camera, which is like that Neptune um, I checked out a few weeks ago. But yeah, that's um, very similar to Jupiter in terms of its band arrangements. But there we go. There is that one. And then lastly, we have got Mr. Missalot's HD. 
So let's see what he has made for us. So here we are over here. So this one is also going with a pale set of colours. We've got some uh, sort of pale lavender colour. We've got some white, some light blues and light greens in there. A, a light pinkish shade and a bit more of the lavender purple down below there as well. So yeah, that is the full lineup of the um, everyone who has submitted an object. So we had six guys submit for this one. Let's get them all lined up now nicely. So radius. So then we'll go over them once more. Right, here we go. So, first of all, we have the bog standard one. So, we completely ignore that one. We can just remove that now, actually. So, let's just uh, line them up once more. So, get rid of the bog standard one. So, yeah, we've got Mad Planet Guys one over here. Then we have got... Uh, this was Mr. Missalots one, wasn't it? Yep, yeah, that was Mr. Missalots. Then we have Zane Bees one here. So, this is the blue and white one. Then we have got um, Exard XD. Yeah, I, I, I'm really sorry. I, I keep scrapping your name. But, yeah, we have got um, his one here. So, there we are. Uh, then we have Gigaman's one. So he's one of the guys who did competitions a lot back in the day as well. So it's good to, it's good to see um, the old guys coming back to continue doing comps as well. So yeah, a lot of you guys have done a lot of these before. So there's Gigaman's. And then lastly, we have got Goomba's one over here. So there is the full lineup. So guys, that is, um, yeah, there's the lineup. So if you would like to vote, let me know which object you think is the best down below in the comments. Or if you're in my Discord server, I will put a poll up. Um, and then you can decide which object you like the most. So, yeah, you can decide. I'll have a poll up. You just react with an icon, and then it will add a vote to whoever you want to vote for. So we're doing a voting system, and I'll also uh, put a vote in there um, as well. And then the winner will be announced in the next Object Competition um, episode. So, yeah, that does it for the re Season 2 of Object Competitions, Episode 1. So, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. And also, if you'd like to submit in the next competition, uh, make sure to join my Discord server. Link in the description. Then we can suggest, discuss which object you guys would like to do next, and then vote on it, and then have it all prepared for the next episode with the winner of today's competition so yeah i really hope you enjoyed this video let's um see if we can go for 30 likes for the return of object competitions guys and yeah um hit that subscribe button as well and helps on the journey to 17,000 subscribers now but yeah there is our lineup of hd 95086b so yeah thoughts and opinions votes let us know down below in the comments or the discord um like i said but with that all said and done guys make sure you have a great day out there stay safe and i'll see you in the next video goodbye okay guys we just had a late submission here it's from the user demonic in discord they're very very lucky to get this from ford actually because i'd literally just finished the filming for the episode but i'll probably just slot this in somewhere um in the episode but yeah we've got one more object here um, for you guys to vote on. So let's go ahead and place it over here. So here we go. This is the user Demonic in Discord. So yeah, very lucky indeed to have this one in here. Let's quickly just buff it up to the correct sort of size. So it's about 139,000. And yeah, here is his object. So let's just uh, put it in the lineup um, with them all here. There we go. Make live. And yeah, here is his submission. So it's a uh, sort of dark pale green object. We can see it's got a bit of orange heat in it as well. We split it at 499 degrees right there. So dark greens and greys. That is his HD950A6B. So yeah, just a final little submission there for you guys to vote on as well. So I'll have to add that um, in the poll for Discord as well. Or let us, like I said, let us know in the comments. Um, I am recording in post. So I probably said that already a bunch of times already. But yeah, just a reminder. Um, but yeah, overall... So that's seven objects we've had in the revival of object competition. So pretty, pretty good. And again, a massive thank you to everyone who uh, sent an object in for today. But with that all said and done, guys, um, hope you uh, enjoy the voting. And yeah, we'll see who wins in the next episode. But yeah, there we are.